Hello everyone! See what the dinner buffet is like on a celebrity cruise. Updated for 2023. We'll show you all the food from our Celebrity Apex cruise for buffet dinner at the Ocean View Cafe. We did a back-to-back 10-night -back cruise on the Celebrity Millennium after 6 nights on the Apex and found that the dinner buffet food there was pretty similar but there were certainly some notable differences. We'll show you what those are towards the end of the video. The Ocean View Cafe Buffet Restaurant is open for dinner nightly from 6 p.m. to 9.30 p.m. So let's get to it, starting with the food you should expect every night at the buffet, and then the ones that are only available once or twice during the entire cruise. I don't like it too rare though. This one is kind of medium rare, medium, medium, medium rare, kind of. Mm. That's good. Tender and smoky. That's good.
last and least favorite. <laughs> Asparagus? Okay, uh huh. So those were the common food items for the buffet we saw nightly. Now let's explore the food that were available just once or twice from our cruise, starting with embarkation dinner. Vegan corner.
olives and tomatoes. Okay. Roasted duck with the duck sauce, duck gravy. Huh, tuck. Okay, here we go. The duck sauce gravy is actually pretty good. Mm. Inside the meat is actually very juicy and tender. The inside, like one here. Do you think that gravy is made from duck? You can taste. I bet you they use the uh, they roast the duck or something, and then they juice the fat from the duck, and they put in that gravy. I bet oh, you that's wow. how they do it. Yeah, the roasted lamb with the lamb leg, or... lamb gravy. Mm. The lamb is um, it's not as tender. It's not as tender. It's a bit dry so too. It's okay. That is really good though. Uh, no, I don't want, I want a chocolate. Uh, Sunday on a Sunday. Ice cream. With all the nuts. And then there should be brownies on the bottom here. Huh? Brownie right there. Mm -hmm. A little bit of ice cream. Some nuts attached to it I love the crunch from all the nuts that's good the brownies not bad I like the ice cream I mean just the ice cream alone with all the nuts here is actually really good 
Is the ice cream better than the ones from the main dining room? The same. The, the ice cream is getting it's kind of watery now, I think. Mm. It's mm. not as high quality ice cream as in the past. Mm. Yeah, that's but what it seems the nuts, like. The nuts make up for it. So it's a little party going on in your mouth with all the nuts and... Papa.
Is that real? Yes. Oh, that's yeah, real? real yeah. yes. Do you guys eat it after? <laughs> Who eats it?
So those were the buffet dinner food items from one of Celebrity's newest Edge class ships, the Apex. Now we'll go over some of the differences versus the dinner buffet on the Celebrity Millennium, which is one of the cruise line's oldest ships. If you've seen our Celebrity Lunch Buffet video, one main difference is that pizza is located directly at the Millennium's Ocean View Cafe, while on the Apex, it was a separate area nearby. The same goes for ice cream. Celebrity definitely still has one of the best ice cream offerings among the major cruise lines. Another difference is that on the Millennium, there was no Mexican food station with the nachos, cheese sauce, chili con carne every night. Plus, on the Millennium, there was no grilled steak or other meats at the quote, grill favorites section. At the carving station, we also did not see lamb or duck throughout our entire cruise aboard the Millennium. And for fruits, on the Millennium, you had to ask a crew member to cut it for you instead of the sliced fruit already available on plates. That could be a positive if you like your fruit freshly cut. Something we did not see on the Apex, which was on the Millennium, it was an extremely popular ramen station open during the next to the last night of the cruise. Check it out! See if the same bras is from the uh, the sushi place. Sushi on on fire. It's it's kind of that bras, but they diluted a little bit. Mm. But it's still good. It's still good. Oh, this is good. Who needs to go there? <laughs> It was what, $11? With, uh, so just wait on. Pork. Yeah, yeah. That pork. Yeah. But here you can have your chicken. Yeah, you, you know, And you can have shrimp. Right. If you want this. Look here. This, this shrimp here. These uh, mini shrimp. But hey, right. still good. And you can have the eggs too. No, this is a good broth. I like it. Yeah. It's just slightly more diluted, but not by much. It's still very good, I think. And you can have all these different type of vegetables, you know, seaweed, bok choy, tofu. See, this is this is awesome. I'm excited. I wonder how the noodle is compared. The noodles, I can feel, it's a good texture. I mean, is it the same as? It's the, not the uh, same. It's not the this same. one is thinner. Okay. Hey, get some seaweed. Always try to make a perfect bite here. There you go. And some tofu. Voila. Mmm, this is good. So good. I highly recommend trying this. It's awesome that they have it for you. This is the darkest miso um, broth I've ever, ever tried. It's very dark, dark, and kind of creamy actually. And salty too. It's actually not not bad. It's not, not as salty. salty as I thought, mm. but it's still kind of salty. Soba noodles. See how that? I always like this by itself. There you go. It's actually pretty salty. Mm. I was trying a little bit, but as it took a good size spoon of the broth. Salty. Um, so this pork, the pork, pork one, one is definitely better. definitely better, much much better. The miso, it's it's way too salty. I think you can add a little bit hot water to it. If that's too salty for you, maybe that will ease the uh, saltiness a little bit. But yeah, it's really salty. And the miso, this one has more of a fermented stronger fermented flavor to it yeah that's that's actually pretty strong miso soup 
And those were the buffet food for dinner you can expect from your next Celebrity Cruises vacation. Plus some of the differences at the Ocean View Cafe between one of Celebrity's newest ships and one of the oldest. Coming up are a few of the dinner buffet highlights other than the ramen station from our Celebrity Millennium Cruise. So what do you think of Celebrity's buffet dinner offerings? What were some of the best food you saw? We enjoy reading your comments and please do give the video a thumbs up if you found it helpful. Thank you very much, happy cruising and we'll see you soon in another video.